Hi, my name is Kuljeet Singh Sandhu. I'm a CEO and founder of Nalwa Aero Private Limited. We are based in India from uh, Punjab province of India. So we are developing a first of its kind five-seater e-vitol there in India. By qualification, I am an electronics and communication engineer. I worked for Vodafone for a few years in radio frequency planning department. Thereafter, a long journey with working with various technical projects. However, I was working in uh, drone industry, but during the COVID, I found that there is a huge crisis in air ambulance facilities available in India. We have just fewer helicopters, just 250 in numbers right now. And out of 250, we are just 50, only 50 around helicopters being used as air ambulance. So from this crisis, I analyzed that thus there is a need of air transportation to make mobility easy. So second part, which uh, encouraged me to enter in the field is the road congestion. The India is 1.4 billion in population. And last 15 years, we have just doubled the number of cars, vehicles on the road, and this graph is going up and up. So what is the way out? That is the only way out. What I found from my study and my understanding is eVTOL, Advanced Air Mobility Concept Development in India. Now, the eVTOL is a little different from helicopter as well. In comparison, if we take, when we talk e, e means electric. So this whole concept is working on a green energy. There is no fuel which is uh, going to giving the carbon emission to the environment. This environment is safe over there. Second thing is eVTOL is of almost 90% less maintainers working operational parameters which helicopters being so costly to work upon. So there are a couple of things, technology and advancement and which, which encouraged me to develop eVTOL and I found eVTOL is just a replacement of helicopter with better efficiency, with better of uh, um, this technology and this is commercially very easy available to public. Yep. During the COVID era, we have started up working on this concept of eVTOL. From there onwards, I developed a team around the world. My main focus was the industry experts who can get a better hands on this, this concept. Uh, after forming the team, it was just to design the concept. So it took almost 2.5 to 3 years to make a perfect model or structure which we are looking for, which is more suitable to the Indian market. Once we have developed the design, then it was just to develop a subscale model to, to, to present the vision and get into the market as well. So in that context, we uh, developed a one is to four model and participated in various, various exhibitions in India. And I would proudly say we got recognized and won innovation of the year award 2023 in India. As of now, with the model, which subscale model, which we have developed it up, it's not a flying, it's just a presentation of concept, how the propulsion system would work over there, how the things would be looking after when it would be in a real phase flying model. So we are next uh, phase is to develop subscale flying model by this year end. Yes, initially uh, it was hard to believe by uh, people masses there that this could happen, that we would be having this concept in a real life over there but now with time passes many companies are coming in people starting appreciating more supporting also government and other companies are also approaching us to develop this concept in india but now we are looking forward uh, for the fundraise soon we are in talking terms with various investors because to develop it on the real ground as uh, a subscale first flying model then full scale flying model it's, it needs a huge investment so uh, conversations are going on but I'm, I'm more happy to get connected with the people who are from the aviation industry who can not just invest in us just also give, bring a good expertise to make this happen in a perfect way if i talk about our 2023 data we have 150 million flyers uh, domestic who travels through airplanes in India last year as well. So this is a huge number. So it means people of India, they have adapted the air mobility through plane. So I think this concept of air mobility through helicopter and this eVTOL would be definitely giving a confidence to us because already the middle class of India has grown up. They have uh, this capacity to pay for this concept and move on with this all air mobility transportation. And if we talk about the last 10 years, maximum very high percentage of uh, class moves to middle plus uh, even. So this is, this is a huge opportunity because their paying capacity has increased 
they are more into the time saving concepts and this is what we are providing to them uh, this is truly said i used to say always uh, with this this concept definitely we can't uh, uh, buy breath for anybody but definitely we can buy time so uh, in india it's not i'm not taking it as just to develop up this evitol this nalva 5x product by me or by any other company i i majorly believe over there just we need to develop the ecosystem of this advanced air mobility first of all in india it includes vertical port first of all because we need to develop this infrastructure so i have a plans we i'm mean, talking terms with some government officials as well that how we can make this uh, infra infrastructure in a better way and use the existing infrastructure likewise as you generally say in a in a big cities and metro cities we have metro stations so that metro stations can be used as a vertical port so uh, this is something already india has developed a huge infrastructure in terms of this uh, metro uh, trains and all that so i believe we have 70% done on infrastructure this concept is majorly for the big cities initially now if i talk about the nalva 5x configuration if you look at the model of the structure of this aircraft you will find that this structure is more look like as a airplane so it's there are few even also the market which are more look like helicopters so with this structure we are gaining huge aerodynamics parameter benefits over there so and uh, another thing if i talk about the propulsion system which we are using is a edf based we have 12 duct fans which we are using up and uh, definitely with this all configurations uh, it makes it more uh, stable in the you know in the air when it is flying this is a capacity of five seaters it can take a payload of up to 700 kg and mtow maximum takeoff weight is of 2000 kg over there this this uh, aircraft nalva 5x has a multiple potential use cases it can be used as a air taxi that's this is a common use which everybody knows about it but it is it can be used as a air ambulance it can be used as a cargo delivery it can be used as a firefighter it can be used as a air sprayer it can be the, there are there are multiple uses which i believe it can be used upon and above all there is a huge need a requirement by the defense services the army for this product to transport uh, troops and other facilities during any emergency or in their routine happenings as well in india we have a huge you know say uh, uh, aviation uh, background over there we have a huge aviation understanding especially if i talk about the southern part of india cities like bangalore these these locations are hub of aviation so uh, it that would be not a big problem for us to uh, hire a right brains right people right technology within india because we want to get this product develop under the tag of make in india made in india so the things which we won't be able to definitely we won't be able to get from india we are open to get it from other parts of uh, the world is it us or there is other developed countries in technology like germany or somewhere so we are open but our main is that 80% it would be developed by the indian uh, vendors or indian technology only uh, today i am uh, here at uh, Silicon Valley presenting India's vision about eVTOL at uh, uh, Santa Clara in USA. So I submit my thanks to Vertical Flight Society who invited me specially for from India to present here. So that's a huge opportunity. They are now creating, as I told, they are creating a uh, ecosystem. They are creating a better networking platform to get connected with the like-minded people over there. So thank you so much, Vertical Flight Society. Thank you so much for providing this opportunity. So I believe we together will make it happen soon. Thank you so much.